F, a robotics company, presented a legged mobile manipulation system capable of playing badminton, leveraging all the robot's joints and relying exclusively on onboard perception. By using control policy, they trained model-free reinforcement learning deployed directly on real hardware with no further fine-tuning. During training, the robot learns to navigate the badminton court and execute precise swings to hit the shuttlecock. Remarkably, complex motion phases emerged without explicitly defined rewards, enabling the robot to engage in extended rallies with human players. Badminton presents unique challenges for legged mobile manipulators. It demands precise coordination between legs and arms to reach interception points outside the static workspace of the arms. The robot must run to position, swing accurately, and tilt its base as needed to optimize each hit. We train the robot to track timed end effector states in simulation, outputting joint position targets for the entire system. Each episode includes multiple swing targets, preparing the robot for consecutive hits. Our approach uses an asymmetric actor-critic architecture, where the critic is granted privileged simulation-only information, such as the number of targets remaining, to better estimate future returns and improve learning efficiency. Beyond coordination, the game demands tight integration of perception and control. The robot tracks the shuttlecock using only onboard sensors, applying color filtering and an aerodynamic flight model to predict its trajectory. Due to the limited field of view of onboard cameras, reliable perception is available only in a brief window during each flight, especially when the robot's base is stationary. To address this, we incorporate a perception model during training that includes sensor noise and camera FOV limits, and we apply a common filter to estimate the shuttle state, both in simulation and deployment. The policy is rewarded for minimizing perception error at the time of the swing, encouraging the robot to balance its base orientation and limb control while improving its perceptual accuracy. We validated the trained policy through extensive experiments, both in simulation and on hardware. The robot's gait adapts dynamically based on the shuttle's location. For short distances, it maintains prolonged foot contact, lifting its feet only to reorient the base for an optimal hit. For longer distances, the robot adopts a galloping gait, adjusting foot contacts to support rapid motion under time constraints. The robot can even adjust its gait to ensure it intercepts the shuttle in time, sacrificing stability for faster movement, even if it means higher foot impact and longer recovery. These results demonstrate the exciting potential of advanced legged manipulators operating in dynamic environments. If you enjoyed the video, please like the video and subscribe the channel for more interesting updates like this.